Hey everybody, it's the Walker. So what are we doing today? Well, today we're doing another episode of Solar Sunday. And we're gonna test out the EC EEN solar panel. It's a 13 watt solar panel. Let's take a look at this. Here's the panel, opens up like this. Showing two panels. Here's one of the cool features. It closes magnetically. I really like that. Also, it has a kickstand which closes magnetically. This enables um, somebody to stand it like this. The angle they've chosen is a pretty good one in my testing. Although, of course, you don't, if you don't want to use it, you don't have to use it. But it seemed to be a pretty effective angle. And there's a kickstand like that. I tested this in high winds. It didn't blow over. Obviously, it's not going to take Hurricane Irma. But um, it's salt. In one second, it just unpacks and then depacks. Depacks? Well, actually, packs up is a better term. These are um, webbing, which is nicely sewn. And the webbing is so you can hang it on the back of your pack. The solar controller has two, um, there we go. You can take two USB plugs. I'm not sure if you'll be able to see this, but um, it lights up when it's, it has enough power to operate, or at least when it's getting light. There's a zipper right here, which is, um, this is like some kind of heavy duty canvas material. Not canvas, I think, um, gosh, uh, like nylon, but it's really heavy duty, like something I'd see in a military pack. It feels like it's almost like a thousand D or something like that, or maybe 500 D, I don't know. But it feels pretty, um, pretty darn sturdy. This is a waterproof, one of those water resistant zippers with a big, um, easy to grab zipper flap. Inside you get, uh, let's see, some beaners. And a uh, regular USB plug. Keep in mind, it's not a lightning, it's not a lightning plug cable. So, if you have an iPhone, you're going to need to use your lightning cable. Let's set this up, run some tests on it. It's that fast. Let's block some of this light so we can see. Okay, we're at um, 5.16 volts. That's good. Let's put it under a load. Um, what do we have? I think we're going to test it using something that can really draw it on a lot of power. This iPad's good for that. There we go. There we are. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. Just a little better for the sun. 4 look at 4. Oh, we have um 4. Point about uh, 4.68, 4.7 volts at um, 1.89 amps. That's pretty close to um, really the maximum I can expect to get here. Let's take a look at what the watts are. Okay, watts are coming 8. Point, um, Oh, look at that. Nearly nine watts. That's very good. 
every three minutes this panel resets and what that does is clear out any charge errors the um, Apple devices have a charge error I, I believe it's um USB accessory oh there it goes all right so we just we just hit the um, the reset and what that reset just did is it cleared out any charge errors and the charge error is USB device um, accessory may not be supported or something like that that's the charge error and what that does is on iOS 10 and above if if you get a big interruption in voltage such as uh, as input such as like a cloud it will then trigger a charge error and your device will not charge until you plug unplug and plug it in what that did is it does it for you every three minutes so it clears out any charge errors so for charging an Apple device these ECEEN panels at least the ones I tested they're excellent for that because they can overcome nearly any uh, type charge error that I've seen that's doing great let's test let's uh, test this for let's see how it actually does over time right now we're at 55 percent let's leave this for a while and we'll see what we get I got things I have to do it's um, roughly 307 we'll actually we'll start the timer see here start and we'll let it run okay let's stop it right here stop one hour and 52 minutes I'll call one hour and 53 minutes okay let's shield it all right let's see 94% charged okay 94% charged that's really really good if I can show it to you again here. All right. 94%. I'm giving the um, ECEEN an enthusiastic uh, thumbs up. It did a really great job. So if you like what you've seen, give me a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button. And uh, thanks for watching, and y'all have a great day.